will we be forced to ban fireworks in Ontario or even in Canada because some idiots decide to let them off on buses full of people? Like, how stupid is that? Now, I can't show you the full video because even though the person's been caught and charged with a misdemeanor for almost killing everyone on the bus, look at the busting cash fire, I can't show you the video on here. I'm sure you'll find it because uh, YouTube will probably um, strike me for showing uh, bad things happening. So we tuned into the radio and here's some of your reactions to uh, banning fireworks. Honestly, I don't really like bans myself, but in my town, in Georgina, North York region, our town actually puts our um, firework display um, every year right above our pound, where the dogs are. At the dog shelter? Right above the dog shelter. Wow, what do you try to do to the dogs? I do know people who actually work there, and when they come in the next day, the dogs are absolutely turned inside out. We've mentioned it, and they don't care. So is that near a fairground area or something? No, it's right in the, like, where the town is, but we also have the pound right there, and they do it directly above it. Going back to the question, you you say you don't you don't agree with bans, no? Things have been banned before. They just don't work. Bans mm -hmm. don't work. So let's go to Mark in Toronto. Mark, how would a ban affect you yourself? It wouldn't affect me personally. I'd like to watch them, yes, but uh, you know, walk go off like uh, Stuart said around May twenty fourth weekend, before and after. Uh, just at the field uh, across the street from me, and it is loud, and it is. Uh, you know, I don't mind. We have a caller from Brampton. Now, fireworks in Brampton, they're banned. So how does it affect him? We, we go twice a year. We go to a big show down at Alfred's Bay, and then we have one usually uh, uh, in, our, in the park next to our house. And we're responsible about it. I think the real problem is is that the police and the politicians don't take what this, these kids are doing seriously a mischief charge no reckless endangerment attempted murder put him in jail for five years that'll send the message that this kind of behavior is unacceptable and that's what'll stop it otherwise when we pat these kids on the head and go there there you made a little mistake we'll let, we'll, we'll, we'll let you off on probation it's never going to change things well, it's really hard to continue after what that guy said that was a proper good run um yeah, well, do you think they should ban fireworks? Not really, I don't think they should. Just leave a comment if you if you firework friendly or firework unfriendly. As far as dogs are concerned, my dog doesn't mind fireworks. It doesn't bother him.